moving to a higher rank within their positions in the fire department. And that's a really big deal in the career in the fire service, moving up through the ranks, different positions, different responsibilities, different assignments. How the ceremony's gonna work is we're gonna bring the people up. They're gonna be pinned in, sworn in by our mayor or the people that are under the Board of Fire and Police Commission by the Chairman of the Fire and Police Commission. I'd like to thank Mayor Mitek for being here today and also the Chairman of our Fire and Police Commission, Patrick Reed, also our City Administrator, Adam McGuire. So, with this, I'd like to have everybody stand at this time. Under guard, post the color. I went a little bit out of order. Uh, Kevin, would you introduce 
Oh, that's right. This is my wife, Stephanie. <laughs> <laughs> and my son is uh, in the Marines. He can't be here tonight, but his girlfriend Grace is here. Today. So, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, thank you very much.
Okay, at this time we're going to move to the rank of captain. And I have to give this gentleman an apology because he's the one that's waited the longest for this event. Mm -hmm. Captain Taro, will you step forward? Go ahead and bring up family and introduce them and then you can meet the others. I have my wife, Laura, here, and my son, Owen, and my mom, Sandy, and my dad's desperately trying to get Haley, my daughter, from Wright Gardens, where she works, where we visit a lot on calls, but she's not going to make it on time, so they're frantic. Jeff joined us also during the lateral transfers of July 04. He moved to lieutenant in April of 16, and he's been a captain since May 17, 2021. The reason I had to apologize is our last ceremony was in April of 2021 when he was still in the promotion process for our captain's list. So he's waited over a year for this moment, even though he's been promoted, he hasn't been able to be officially recognized. So I apologize for the delay. So this time I'd like to introduce Andrew Reed, Chairman of the Fire and Police Commission. I Jeff Taro, I Jeff Taro, you solemnly swear or affirm, solemnly swear or affirm that I will support the Constitution of the United States. I will support the Constitution of the United States. The laws of the state of Illinois. The laws of the state of Illinois. The ordinances of the city of St. Charles. The ordinances of the city of St. Charles. And the rules and regulations of the Board of Fire and Police Commissioners. That I will faithfully discharge the duties of the office of captain.
have Ann Davis, a second generation member of the department. His dad was on the department before him. As a matter of fact, Dave's dad was my lieutenant when I came out as being a call firefighter. Next, I would like to call Captain Rainier Galliano. In the audience, I have my mother, my father, my brother, my nephew, several dear friends, and I call it Mother. Okay.
November 2012. And as of today, he's receiving his first promotion as of September 19th to Lieutenant. Brad served in many capacities and he's recently been appointed the quartermaster. The quartermaster in our department is in charge of all the uniforms and turn up here and protect the equipment.
and they exhibited great attitudes and strong skills. So as of April 19, 2022, Austin finished his probation, was accepted by the Board of Fire and Police Commission, and this is the first ceremony since then. So we'll recognize his position of firefighter permit. Aye, Austin. Aye, Austin. You solemnly swear or affirm that I will support the Constitution of the United States. Thank you. 